I want to commend you for how you have constantly supported nuclear thermal, nuclear electric, but I want to ask you to consider pouring on the juice uh, because that nuclear propulsion would give us a way to get to Mars quicker. And if we can get to Mars quicker, then we don't have to stay there for a long, long time until the planets realigned. Now, China is completely a different experience for vis-a-vis -vis the U.S. space program because there has not been any transparency. Uh, they are very secretive. So it's been a very strained relationship with the Chinese space program. What is the extent of cooperation with uh, Russia between Russia and China? I'm simply not sure. Now that we have uh, gotten the, the White House uh, approval of extending the space station until 2030, if you all appropriate the funds, um, and of course what we want to do is continue it until we have a commercial space station and then deorbit uh, an aging uh, space station. Uh, both of you mentioned uh, James Webb Space Telescope. My goodness, in one month, we're going to have the first pictures. And it's going to be from light that has traveled at the speed of light, 186,000 miles per second, traveled for 13 and a half billion years. Just think of the discoveries that we're going to have of this thing called the universe that is too big for me to even conceive it. Think of the questions we're going to answer of which we don't even know what the questions are right now as a result of what we're going to learn. 